Hit him, Kenny. Hit him, Knock Kenny. this guy out. Happily. Jesus. Hey. Oh, man. That's right, God damn it. I'm loyal to gang, 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 gang. Not today, buddy. Nah, it's today. Oh! Man. You're getting weak, Lee. You're getting really weak, bro. You okay? Just great, thanks. That gunshot. He's supposed to stab him in the head. Everyone, no gun sounds. Any sounds. Bring him in. I don't know. Thank God for whatever it is. We almost died because of this bitch and a Richie trigger finger. That was stupid. That was. Uh, uh, then you yeah. get knocked out, fam? What's wrong with him? It's his heart. My pills. Um, nitroglycerin pills? Yes, we're out. We've been trying to get into the pharmacy since we got here. Please try to get in there. Behind the counter where the pills are. I shouldn't get shit. There's probably another entrance. Maybe through the office. How do you know that's an office? Uh, educated guess. It doesn't matter. We need nitroglycerin pills. Please get in there. I'll keep an eye on my dad. Everyone else should get comfy and look for anything useful. We could be in here a while. I'm starting to think this drugstore isn't a permanent solution. You're right. This ain't exactly Fort Knox. What do you suggest? We need as much gas as possible so we can all get out of downtown Macon. Fast. Agreed. Then I'll head out and get gas. There's a motel not too far from here, out towards the end of Peachtree. I'll work my way towards it and then loop back, siphoning what I can. Is that Glenn? You know your way around? Local? Born and raised. If you're gonna do that, here's a walkie-talkie if you get in a tight spot. Hopefully, you won't need it. Cool. Clementine's got the other one. Check in with her and get back here as soon as you can. And you? What's your name? It's Lily. My dad's Larry. Keep a good eye on him. These boys will work on getting you your medicine. That's right. And you, you keep an eye on that front door. You're our lookout. It's Doug. You got it. And I'm Carly. Okay, Carly. You'll shift in with Doug when he needs it. For now, get some rest. You're a good shot, and I'd like to keep it that way. You got it, boss. Now get him She's already calling pills. them boss. See how we come in and just take over shit? You know what I'm saying? That's what we do. We, we can't follow. We gotta lead. It's like in our blood. Let's check out these newspapers. Central High Tech State. Papers a week old. Feels like years. What are you messing around with there? A radio. I can't get it to work though. Here, let me have a look. Check out this radio. Hmm. Have you tried the power? Uh, oh, nothing. she did. She did. Let's turn it around. There are hey. no batteries in this thing. What now? You know that there are no batteries in that thing. Yeah, of course. I, I mean, yeah. No. <laughs> I can try to find some. Needs two. Thanks. I wouldn't even really know what to look for. Batteries? Heard or seen anything? Nothing, luckily. Wanna step outside, have a look around? <laughs> I'm not suicidal yet. Right. No, the gate out there is closed. We can hang out in front of the store and be fine. Oh, huh. Uh, not now. Uh, not right now. All right, let me know if you want to. We'll probably come back later. I want to finish checking out the store and stuff. See if it's some food or something. What's in here? Looks like nobody got a chance to donate anything before this all went down. Let's see what's up with Clemmy. She's just 
dealt with a traumatic experience. Hey there. Hi. Can I, uh, get you anything? I'm okay. Maybe I'm a little hungry. I'll see you Maybe. We should get to know each other. Why so, um... Are you okay? What? Uh, yeah. Yeah, I'm, I'm fine. I just, uh... I'm good. That's good. Yeah, I think so. Uh, being good is good, despite the circumstances. Yep. All right. Any word from Glenn? Nothing. Is he okay? Yeah, I think so. You're doing a good job. We'll sit tight. Okay. Look, we got a candy bar or something right here. Probably get this to Clemmy. Clemmy. It's not damaged. Glad this place didn't get looted. Another energy bar. Oh, we having another one. See if claim me some food. It's not much, but here you go. Thank you. Of course. But nobody eat before Clement's time. Doesn't look sanitary. I can't. I can't think about them in here. Let me leave real quick just so I can. I didn't get to speak to um, Lily and Larry, and I want to make sure I talk to anybody because sometimes people give you clues and things like that. So. How's he doing? I'm not sure I got your name. It's Lee. Lily. My dad's Larry. It's a lot of L's. But we don't take those. We don't take I was just doing what I had to earlier. Everyone was. Now his heart's acting up again and I'm powerless to do anything. And that violence before with my dad, that didn't help. You're from here? I work at Warner Robins, the Air Force Base. Yeah, I know it. Pilot? Nah, just mechanical admin stuff. I deal with a bunch of shitheads and bureaucrats all day. Sometimes a plane, if I'm lucky. You? I work up at UGA. Is that like University of Georgia or something? I guess so. What do you think about all this? What's wrong with him? Is anyone was here? Was anyone here when you guys got here? No, this place was pretty wrecked. We pulled a couple of bodies out of the office. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. Must have been his parents. Did you know anybody here? Let's be honest. Yeah, the owners, yeah. they were, uh, we were close. I'm sorry. We found an older couple in the office. Dad hauled them out in case they weren't really dead. What's wrong with him? He's got a heart condition. He takes nitroglycerin tablets pretty regularly. I've seen a few bad attacks that he couldn't get over and needed to go to the hospital. Yeah, that's uh, not really an option right now. I'm just trying to keep him relaxed. He's got a temper. Oh, Damn right he does. Yeah. Fuck he does it. It's just that. Yeah. We've got kids here. Family. He and I are a family. I'm just saying some people can't handle a temper like that. Hell, barely seems like you can. It's just his way. Don't make him the reason everything's screwed. Where's her mom? Savannah, I think. Oh, you guys aren't together. Oh, uh, no, I'm not her dad. I found her in a house when getting out of Atlanta. She'd been surviving by herself. I think the girl's parents didn't make it. Oh. I heard an answering message. They were in Savannah. She was home with a sitter. It wasn't good. Well, she's lucky to have you. Oh, that was nice. 
What do you think about all this? What is there to think? The dead are up, walking around, eating people, and turning them into more... more of them. I mean, Jesus. We need to stick together and get through this. I'm gonna get back to him. Sounds good. Hey there. This is Glenn, and uh, I'm kinda in a jam here. Uh, little girl, if you're there, can you put your daddy on the phone? Or on the talkie, or whatever? I swear, that's the same. This is Lee. What's the voice up? actor is the so real actor for Glenn. So, I'm down at that motor in, and, well, uh, I'm stuck. Stuck? Yeah, I uh, saw a chance to get some supplies for the group, and a bunch of the Roman ones got the jump on me. I'm hiding over here, but they won't leave. What's up? Glenn's trapped down at the motor inn. Hey, Glenn, we're gonna talk it over and send a group to come get you, all right? <sighs> awesome. I'll sit tight till then. Sounds good. I'm gonna hold on to this until we get Glenn back, okay? I'll take good care of it. What do you think? I think Doug's not great around zombies. You got your family here. I'll take Carly and her dead eye down to the motor inn, get Glenn, and get back here as fast as I can. If that's what you want to do, somebody's got to. Yeah, I'm in. Good. Doesn't sound too bad there right now. Let me know as soon as you want to head out. I could use a jog. <laughs> a jog. Alright, so before we head out, we're going to go check out the back room. Oops, let's get some more food. Can't help. Can't hurt. Someone might need that in the future. Wait, did I get it? Okay. Oh, we I didn't can't even let talk anything to them. happen to Ducky. Hey, Lee. Maybe punching him wasn't such a good idea. There were worse plans. Says the guy who didn't get punched in the mouth. Anyway, we, Cat and I, appreciate your support. Thank you, Lee. Oh, cause I ride for y'all. You know what I'm saying? Like y'all ride for me. You did. You know what I'm saying? That's what that's what family do. What's the plan? Hang tight, I suppose. Seems pretty dangerous out there, so we ought to wait for things to clear up. You said your family was from here in Macon? That's right. Where are they? Should we go looking for them? Nah, they're gone. They, uh, own this place. They, uh, pulled some bodies out of the office before we got here. They're, uh, gone. Oh, sweetie. Cat. They were good people. I wasn't around much, but yeah, they're dead. I'm gonna just Lee, exit. You got a second? Sure. What's on your mind, Ken? Back on Herschel's farm. Yeah. We didn't even try to save him. That blood is on our hands, Hell you know? No. It happened pretty fast. I guess. But I can't stop seeing him in my head. We can't kill ourselves. Over we him. killed that boy. We could have saved him together. No, you ran away like a bitch. That's what you happened. did. We didn't make a choice that killed Sean. You think you do when you look back on it. But in a moment, when things are really out of control, you don't have any choice. I guess. Oh, Ken could have stayed, bro. Try to let it go. He should feel like shit. He could have stayed. He ran away after I saved his kid. All right, now let's go up in here and check out this back home. This door leads to the back alley. Check this first aid kit. Luckily, there's nothing I need in here. I think that's it. What's that? This was my dad's cane. He'd zip around here on it from time to time. Was he sick? Nah, he was okay. I actually saw him whoop shoplifters with it. <laughs> this cane's protected this place better than any guard dog ever could. Plus, he knew how to make it look cool. Like you with your hat. My dad gave it to <laughs> me. 
See, Dad's just smart like that. Oh, the feels. Right, let me see if there's something over here. We gotta clear this door for when we find the keys. True. Better get this door clear, huh? Can I help? Sure. Here we go. Watch your fingers in the drawers. Mm. How are you doing? Yeah, it's not that heavy. How about with everything outside? It's not good. No, it's not. But I think it'll be okay. okay. Optimism. Here we go. <laughs> Look at her face. <laughs> Do you have kids? No. You don't have a family? What do your parents do? My mom is a doctor and my dad is an engineer. Oh, those are good Cha jobs. Cha -ching. What's your job? I uh, teach history and writing and things like that. Like um, um, social studies? Yeah, like that. You didn't answer my question. All right, a little further. <sighs> Your school called history, social studies. You are in the. Why don't you want to talk about school. your family? Facts. Do they like hate you? Let's just tell her the truth. They did fail. Because they're dead. Oh, I'm sorry. You didn't know. Well, that's okay. Yours is I'm too. I'm just sorry for being mean. Look, my family's gone, and I just wish things would have been different. Yeah. I'm not a bad guy, okay? Things happen, and we didn't talk much after that. My parents don't talk to me when I get in trouble. I can relate. Let's call that good old silent treatment. Ow! Oh, Are you okay? I hurt bleeding. my finger. Is it bleeding? A little. I'll find you a bandage. Wasn't in the first aid, right? Great, up there, great, great. There. Let's have a look at that finger. How? It hurt. Let's see if we can do something about it. Let's get this cut covered up. Yes, please. Come home, and I'm not there. All right, I'm Lee. gonna keep it a hundred with her. Just keep this shit all the way a hundred. I don't think they will. They want you to be safe. We'll find them if we can. I've got my walkie talkie in case they try that way. Stay close to me until then, okay? Oh, baby. Wait, maybe some batteries in here or something for that uh, radio. Who knows? Family picture. Man, his parents were fit. Wow. Find anything? It's not that seriously. They loved you too, bro. I'm keeping it all the way honest. It's a photo of the family who owned this place. It might help us track down the keys to the office. I know who you are. You're Lee Everett. You're a professor at Athens who killed a state senator who was sleeping with your wife. This is your parents' store. Folks around town know the owner's son got himself a life sentence, but I'm a reporter for WABE in Atlanta. I paid attention to that trial. Damn, that's what I did? Maybe you're a murderer, but I don't really care. Frankly, that's a skill that might come in handy. True. 
Did you tell anyone out there who you were, or that you were tied to this place? It's the the world is ending out there. Who cares who I am? If you don't think people will find any reason to turn on you, especially when the shit hits the fan, you're insane. Whatever. You seem like an okay guy, and the last thing we need is drama out there. You've got this little girl to take care of, and... Look, don't make me wrong on this. I don't plan to. Good. Because if this lasts longer than a few days, and you're a detriment to the group, then we'd have a problem. I hear you. I'll just keep it to myself. Please do. I trust her. Thanks. Don't worry about it. Oh, she liked that. Show me how much you like that. 